Welcome back to Australian Immigration Updates. Join our WhatsApp group for latest immigration news and updates. Link is given in description. Today, we're diving deep into the biggest changes shaking up Australian immigration policy in 2024. From brand new visa options to important updates on existing programs, we've got everything you need to know. So let's get started. Skills and Demand Visa Australia is looking to tackle its labor shortages head on with the all new skills and demand visa, replacing the temporary skill shortage, subclass 482 visa. This streamlined option offers a four year term and a clear pathway to permanent residency. This is great news for skilled migrants seeking a stable future in Australia. We'll discuss the eligible occupations, application process, and how this visa benefits both migrants and employers. Genuine student requirement, for our international student viewers, there's been a shift in visa requirements. Gone is the genuine temporary entrant GTE requirement. In its place, we now have the genuine student GS requirement. We'll break down what this means for student visa applications, the focus on genuine study intentions, and how to ensure your application meets the new GS criteria. Migration program planning levels. The Australian government sets annual migration program planning levels. This year, the focus is on permanent residency opportunities. We'll explore the allocated places for skilled migration streams, the reduction in business innovation and investment program, BIIP visas, and how these changes impact different immigration pathways. Increased migration skills assessment fees. Heads up for those seeking skills assessments. From July 1st, 2024, Migration skills assessment fees will increase by 3 to 4%. We'll discuss the rationale behind this change, the updated fee structure for different professions, and how to plan your application budget accordingly. Pacific Engagement Visa Calling all Pacific Islanders Australia introduced the brand new Pacific Engagement Visa, a permanent residency pathway specifically designed for citizens of select Pacific nations. We'll explore the eligibility criteria benefits of this visa, and how it strengthens Australia's relationship with Pacific Island nations. High Court Decision on Visa Cancellations In a landmark case, the High Court of Australia recently delivered a judgment regarding visa cancellations. We'll break down the legalities of this case, its potential impact on future visa cancellation processes, and the importance of seeking legal advice if facing visa issues. Phew, that's a lot of changes to unpack. Remember, this is just a starting point. We'll keep you updated on all the latest developments. Don't forget to check out the resources and links in the description box for further information on the Department of Home Affairs website, Australian Government Department of Home Affairs Immigration website. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below and hit that subscribe button for more Australian immigration updates.